यार एक चेयर और ले आओ सर कर ले कर ले कर ले Uh, okay, thank you very much, everybody, and um, thank you for your warm welcome to your beautiful country of, of Pakistan. Um, I'm obviously very pleased to, to be here. Uh, we have some really exciting plans. We all know the potential um, of Pakistan, the size of the country, the population. I think 220 million, I was told, is the, is the population, and it's a very young country as well. Uh, it's a country that really loves its sport. Um, we've seen success over years in games like cricket and hockey, and we also know that it's got a huge passion uh, for football as well. Um, participation in football, and of course uh, the structure of football here, is something that we can all improve on. And, and this is uh, the job of, of uh, the people um, besides me here today. But I just wanted to say that it's a very exciting. Venture. I'm so pleased to have partnered um, with Global Soccer Ventures, with Red Stripe, with St. Patrick's. Um, I think it's a great team, and I really look forward to an exciting future. And let's hope that we can unearth some real talent here in Pakistan. Um, and who knows, we can have some stars of the future in the football field as well. Thanks once again for your warm welcome. Michael, as you mentioned, that Pakistan has a lot of talent in all fields of sports. What do you think about the Pakistan telling uh, specifically in football? Well, it remains to be seen. That's one of the reasons that I'm out here to, uh, this week is to, uh, to have a look and, and to see um, the quality of some of the, the players that are on trial and, and doing the training sessions as we speak. Um, we have some very good coaches out here that are, uh, of course, teaching um, young Pakistani players um, the game. I can't believe that there isn't a lot of talent uh, out here. I know that uh, a lot of people watch football all around the world, but I know there's a huge passion for football here. Um, I know that people play it uh, out with their friends. Um, so I can't believe that there's not a lot of natural talent out here. And um, our job is to try to unearth that talent and then give that talent the opportunity to display itself around the world and of course that's where St. Patrick's um, and the whole uh, setup here is, uh, is designed to do. What will be your message to the youth of the Pakistan? Well the message is, uh, is that it is possible I, I guess to, uh, to become a professional footballer. Um, where you're from shouldn't count against you, there should be always opportunity and that's what we're trying to create here. Um, and as I said, there is bound to be um, some young footballers that have got a lot of ability that just need the opportunity, and that's what we're trying to create. Well, that has to be the dream in the future. <laughs> um, first of all, we want to give opportunity. That is the most important thing. Um, of course, in time, the facilities will get better, maybe new stadiums, a new league, all these things will, will come in the future. But first of all, you need to have opportunity, you need to have a, a hunger to, uh, to play the game and I know that there is that passion and that hunger uh, in Pakistan so I think we have to go step by step and to start with this is a, 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 very, uh, a very exciting time and maybe the, the seeds will grow from this in the future and who knows in 10, 20 years then we might be saying Pakistan are a part of a, a real, well is a real strong footballing nation and maybe part of, of a World Cup in, in years to come. To so people that love football, I know that there's a huge um, group of people out there that have a massive uh, passion for, for football, uh, and we want to, to give that opportunity um, to start with. We know it will be a, a long-term project. Um, nobody can turn Pakistan into a, a, a World Cup winning nation straight away. Um, but what we can do is create opportunity for young people to actually learn about the game, to improve their game, and then give them the opportunity to play the game at a high level. And once you do that, then you will see in years to come that Pakistan's world ranking in football will start to gradually improve. It won't be a short-term thing, as I say, but I do think um, we have a lot of exciting plans for the future. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And I would like to... Man, man, man. Man, man, man.